a powdery mildew species with a large host range of over 100 genera, Golovinomyces sicurociarum, formerly of the genus Erisiphi, has been documented on lettuce, sunflower, cannabis, cucumber, and other cucurbits. It is an obligate epiphytic parasite, infecting the surface-level cells of its host, extracting nutrients through tendril-like projections called hostoria. There are many pathovars adapted to specific hosts, making their infection more successful than related strains. As with many powdery mildews, Golovinomyces sicoricerium most often reproduces asexually, producing conidia in the process. Commonly associated with Spherotheca fuliginea, due to a shared host range and similar morphology, Golovinomyces sicoricerium is not apparently distinguishable from other powdery mildews without an assessment of its microscopic morphology. Many parts of the world document its presence. According to Labetta and Mislarova, dry, hot weather is favorable for development, including the hotter zones of North America, like Salinas Valley, in the USA. Conidia can easily disperse 120 miles or more in bundles via air currents, and sexual fruiting bodies which hold spores, called chasmothesia, will burst from the absorption of water at 15 to 22 degrees Celsius. Conidia can withstand negative 10 degrees Celsius for 24 hours, but most cannot survive negative 5 degrees Celsius at 168 hours. Conidia require approximately 8 to 10 hours between 5 to 33 degrees Celsius to develop apressoria, and the process of cell penetration takes about 10 to 17 hours at 10 degrees to 27 degrees Celsius. Infection takes approximately 120 hours all told, but infection is most optimal between 18 and 25 degrees Celsius, and slower between 10 and 15 degrees Celsius and over 30 degrees Celsius. Relative humidity has no effect on development post-infection, and conidia will germinate between 50 and 97% humidity, and is inhibited at 100%, as well as under prolonged periods of moisture on the leaves. Despite this information, Life history data is lacking for this species. It was suggested in the book, Diseases of Oilseed Crops, that a pathovar adapted to Heliathus anis sunflowers might be controlled by the mycophagus lady beetle Ileus cincta, as a Diractin has also been demonstrated to affect development, as well as other fungicidal compounds made to affect the physiology of the powdery mildew family, Erisiphiles. However, most are single-site inhibitors, which are highly susceptible to resistance through a change in target physiology.